Okay, I'm back. One, two, three, and... You see that there? That's the boat. That's the boat that Dutch and Jack worked on over the summer. And no, the job didn't get finished. But it's a lot closer to being finished. I think the boat will float now. So if we have a flood... Whoop. <laughs> anyway, I haven't been out on the trail for days. Days, maybe weeks, but I'm headed out this morning. I really don't have the time for it, but I said, I'm going to do it anyway. It was 56 degrees on the app of my phone. I stepped outside and it felt colder than that, so it rained. Well, it started raining late last night. Wow, do you hear that? I was in here working and suddenly I heard stuff on the roof. Oh, it's blowing in on me. Oh, I gotta shut the door. Hang on. I like that. All right. I like the sound of the rain. Sometimes though, rain. Wow, I don't like this. It's reflecting. Never mind. Bye. Uh, and it was loud and it surprised me. I didn't think we were supposed to get rain. Evidently, I didn't know. <laughs> I, I have to admit, I just thought we weren't going to get rain. I never checked the forecast. I just made that assumption. <laughs> uh, okay. So I'm hitting the trail. Looks like it's going to be a fairly good day. At least it's not really raining right at the moment. At the moment. But the raindrops are holding on. Aren't they cute? Look at that. So cute. Okay. I ran a mile. That was it. That's... I don't have time to go further, but I wanted to go check out the back of the property. I came back by the boat and I see an issue here. Yeah, that's going to be trouble. <laughs> uh, and it's heavy. I tried to pull it out with one hand. So the idea was that it tents away from there. Oh, I just stepped in a puddle of water. Now my foot is all wet, so it's good I'm headed back to the house because it's cold out here, and that's cold water. Well, what did I say, 54? Did I say 56 degrees? Either one, in the 50s. And I'm gonna be stuck inside all day, folks. That's, that's it. I work, I gotta stay inside. That's why I decided, even though I didn't have time, I made the time to come out here this morning. Because <sighs> I'm just gonna be stuck in the house. Stuck, 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 stuck. Okay, I'm not really stuck. I'm just being a little dramatic. Okay. Maybe I'll record something later today, and maybe we'll just pick this up tomorrow. It is 11.07 p.m., and I have been working. Sometimes working is good. Sometimes it leaves me time to think. I was thinking... I think this is the first day I haven't cried since my son died. And then I said, oh no, this morning when I got pictures of my grandson, of Dale's son, who I haven't seen since he was two and he's almost seven, I cried. Okay, these are happy tears, sort of, kind of. No, they're sad tears. So many years. Oh boy, it's not what I was going to talk about today, but as I went to pull my camera out, the message came in with the photos, and I couldn't get past that. Oh boy, you guys, this is so hard. So, so hard. I thought, well, those were, those were, that was okay. They were kind of happy tears, because I had to see my grandson, at least photos of him. He looks the same as he did last time I saw him, just, oh, the light went out see if I can get it. There we go. But tonight, I've been thinking about him as I've been working. And I just thought, if I'd known the last conversation I had with him was going to be the last conversation, would, have I, would, I, have, would I have said things differently? Yes. I didn't know that he was sick, but he was sick. He told me he wasn't doing well. And sometimes he would tell me that. And I, you know, you don't think about it. You know, yeah, I'm not doing well. Like this morning, I woke up with a headache. I'm not doing well. You know, that kind of thing. He seemed, he seemed okay. Okay. So far, I haven't made it a single day since he died without crying. In some aspects, it's starting to get easier. 
always told him, I love you. He always said, I love you. That's how we ended our conversation. I love you. Let's change the subject here. Okay, I need a break. Hang on. Hey, Wilder, what you got there? You got a blankie? <laughs> oh, you're a funny little doggie. 